Hello everybody, welcome back to the channel. Good to see you. It's nearly the weekend. Let me know what you're going to be up to and I hope it's a good thing, whatever it is. Thank you very much for the support for the channel, by the way. If you haven't subscribed yet, please do. It's free, no obligation whatsoever. And if you've been subscribed for a little while, obviously make sure that little red button is still hit. And of course, like the video, share the content and have a chat with everybody. Well, somebody went into a local Tesco's had a bit of a shock when they tried to leave. What they decided to do was email me and tell me about it. So naturally, I'm going to tell you. And, uh, you know, just to let you know this kind of thing's out there. It's to do with a security device, uh, to do with trolleys when you leave the shops. Uh, I know this technology, technology's been out there for a while, but I'll, I'll relay the story just in case you don't. So here it is. It's an email. And again, we'll call this person M for anonymity's sake. Hi Andy, I see you've been running stories on supermarkets recently. Mm. Uh, I had a bit of a surprise at Tesco in Bishop Storford this morning. I've been up that way. I'm going up that way tomorrow, actually. Uh, well, Stansted, so fairly close. I popped in to buy cat food and as usual, we used the scan and pay. So... I've got my new Felix, as good as it looks. Unfortunately, Aldi don't sell this brand, and I have fussy cats, and I've got a few other bits. I paid at the self-service checkout and headed for the exit at pace, as time and tide wait for no man. As I passed through the door, the front wheels of the trolley abruptly locked up, causing me to decelerate rapidly. I thought this was odd. I'd never heard of a supermarket trolley wheel seizing before, so as I was checking for a mechanical fault, a member of staff came over to assist. I then noticed an alarm was sounding. Once she checked my receipt against the shopping in my bag, she pointed a device at the wheel and it released the brake. She explained the new security system had a fault where goods passing through the self-service checkouts don't have their security tags disabled, therefore stopping the trolleys from moving. However, as I made another attempt to pass through the door, a lady behind me, having also used the scan and pay checkout, set off the alarm again. This had the effect of locking her trolley up too. I can understand why the greedy crooks at Tesco need to stop scumbags feeding from their shops, but it was an unpleasant and slightly humili humiliating experience. I'm going back to Aldi later to do the big shop. I'll give Greenwich a miss. Unfortunately, Aldi don't sell Felix, and my cats, as I said, are fussy. Keep up the good work. I have seen that technology before in shops. We've got one down the road from us, and it's not so much shoplifting. It's more stopping people nicking the trolleys themselves. I've seen them in the middle of Margate High Street after they're all out on a Friday night on the old hey, crazy stuff. But that technology is out there, just, just be warned. Your trolley will disable itself for a reason. So look out and hold on tight. Anyway, I'm off. I'll see you shortly with one more. Toodaloo.